Well, Monday morning, how are you? You doing good? Good to hear. Well, I haven't given up on Time Bomb. I think that's still gonna go down pretty good, and I'm gonna give it a try on some new people today. Time Bomb! Everything's looking up, Eric, today on a Monday. Got a call from the office. Not too bad, Sherry, and how are you? You're welcome, you have yourself a wonderful day. You know what? Not to quote Vanilla Ice here, but if there's a problem, yo also. I think it'd just have to be a little more subtle with Time Bomb. Just, it's a little dusty in here, so. It is, yeah. I don't want to breathe it in. No, exactly, it's, it's a Time Bomb in here. Yeah, exactly. That's pretty subtle, I think. Okay, Time Bomb, eh? Time Bomb. All right, Time Bomb. Um, I got something really cool given to me. I, I gotta show it to you, I'm pretty happy about it. It's a, it's a Keurig. It is used. It was in a storage room somewhere and uh, I don't know, maybe you can answer this question. I've just taken a mixture of vinegar and water uh, just to clean it out. So I'm just going to run a few cycles of it. But I ran one cycle uh, through it and, and just tell me if this is normal that they sound like this. All right, let's see. Okay. Now is it, is that the sound that they make? Are they normally that loud when they kick on there? when the furnace comes on. I think there's a furnace that kicks on first or whatever. Now that's quiet there, it's pouring the water out there. Is that normal to have the furnace sound of it kicking on at first? That uh, really loud sound, I, I don't know. You see there it goes again. It's kicking into like a second thing. I, I don't know if that's normal. I don't ever remember a Keurig being that loud. Oh there, I can hear again. Maybe it's not that loud to you guys at, at home but uh, Seems pretty loud here. Anyways, maybe you can help me out with that. Otherwise, you know, I'm back to old, uh, old drippy here. This one feels right. I feel like I'm cheating on this one. Look at that. They won't even look at this one. This one over here is giving this one the dirty eye. <laughs> Somebody's a little bit jealous, are we? <laughs> Once again, I'm gonna try another load here. Maybe that's my new life. Have like a loud Keurig. Maybe that's what I'll be known for. You know Eric? Yeah, that loud Keurig guy? Yeah, yeah, that's him. Time bomb, eh? It'll be funny, It'll be funny if, this, if I have to put up with this. Hello? I, I'll have to call you back. The Keurig's on. I'm sorry, can you speak up? The Keurig's on right now. Yeah, no, go ahead. Do we have a sign? Can I get a, like a hearing protection sign maybe on? Maybe it's just working out some bugs. Maybe because it sat around for a while. That could be it too, you know? Oh, I gotta add water now. Time bomb. Get ready for the rock concert. Afraid it's gonna explode or something. I'm gonna stand here. You all right? Christopher Sunbeam, you keep it down, you. It's fine. You're important too. Neither one of you are better than the other. You both have a lot to offer. Even noisy here. Maybe that's what it is. Maybe the Keurig's warming up to the other coffee maker being here. That's what's going on with me today. How are you? Monday, don't be depressed. And if you are, you can feel better. Just take a deep breath. By the time you're watching this, Monday probably is over. You'll be fine. You'll be fine. today um who said are you sure it was your dad that got shot you all look the same fuck you buddy we don't all look the same i will hook you i will hook you hard because you know what we're just like normal people like you were sorry i thought i saw a car coming <laughs>